How's it going, Dazzlers? Welcome back to Daz Games and another Daz Watches. The art <clears throat> of speaking. <laughs> the art of dance. Some people think it's for sissies, but until you've tried to stand on the ends of your toes, you don't know. And it's not for the faint of heart, it requires years of dedication. And what's worse? than putting strain on your legs. Competitive mothers who just want their daughters to succeed and win every trophy there is. Like pageanting, which we've uh, reviewed on the channel many times. These dance mums are probably worse. I've never really watched dance mums before. So forgive me for not knowing who and what the hell everything is. You guys have wanted me to react to dance mums for a long time now. I've got a compilation here of arguments and you know extreme moments from the series i don't know how i don't know how extreme dance competitions can get but we're gonna we're gonna find out together here today let's watch a video i do not raise brats you are a monstrosity of evil at least you're on it let her wear the costume no do it get I'm your finger, finger do you out want of my go? face don't you dare try and make my child look like that police right okay that sounded like walking through the park and a flock of geese took off. That was a turkey. <laughs> You're our top four. Fourth place overall mother, that's Chloe. Oh shit, that's Maddie Ziegler. Oh yeah, that's where she started. Didn't she like leave, get really famous for being friends with Sia and then spoke badly about the show's leader or whatever her name is, the big woman who like runs everything. I think that's what happened. I don't like to lose. Oh, there she is! Ah, oh, she's adorable, isn't she? I remember when I saw her in the Sia video, I was like, Jesus Christ, I'm exhausted just watching this. Incredibly talented little girl. But I don't ever lose anyway. And very confident. We, we like that. And our first place overall top scoring advanced mini soloist receiving a $75 check. $75? That's the prize. Do they split that between all of the girls? Get like a dollar each? There's like 75 girls up there! What are you gonna do with $75 in America? That won't pay for a kidney transplant. And the trophy is a cry. That's Maddie from Abbey Dance Company. Okay, so to my knowledge, these are mums, okay? And this woman here is like, she runs the dance school. And she's, I think she's the one that teaches them how to dance and does all the routines. I'm not sure. I might be wrong. Congratulations, you have run applause for our top scores. Let's give a big round of applause. Undefeated. Aren't you happy? Congratulations, you guys take that. Oh, bitch. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna call it right now. This here is Maddie's mum. That is not. <laughs> oh, bitch. Can... I swear, sometimes, and I said it in the pageant videos, that these mums try and live their, their dreams through their kids. To, to this mum here, it's, it's not about... Maddie up there winning. In her mind, she won. This is not fair. Chloe was learning a oh, Maddie just just walking off stage with all the gold. She do did she melt all that down and give it to Sia and say, please let me be in your video. That's what I would have done. Is that that was that the origin story of Maddie Ziegler? I don't know. Nine year old to go on stage and like be flawless. Our kids were set up to fail. Are you really in that hallway or is that a green screen? Because if you're in that hallway, you're just screaming. Kids could probably hear you, love. I'm so excited for you because she you got know, the we best We don't want to ruin the weighted victory. I'm not ruining today. No, Abby, what, what, we need to go in the same? hallway. Don't be doing this why in front of my daughter, same? Chris. Abby. Oh, someone's been drinking. We can all go in the hallway because I tried to talk to you and I tried I'm to stop talking to you. Why would you all go in the hallway? You're already in one room. This is why I, I don't do well in argumentative situations. I would just, um, I make things worse. <laughs> Abby, I'm not talking about You're making, making my daughter cry, so shut up. Talk about what? Yeah, how many times has my daughter beat your daughter this year? Oh! Damn! Why have I missed this show? Rich woman arguing? I'm here for it! God, look at this girl, look. Jesus Christ. They're just making all these... Like, I, I feel like these kids love dance and they just want to go, they want to dance. I don't think they really care about winning. I didn't care about winning anything as a kid. And these mums are just so like, my kid beat your kid. Like, it's so, like, grow up, man. Like, the kids seem like way more grown up than the adults in these TV shows. Fight! We were stacked against everybody 
party this weekend because... Oh, shit. Maddie's crying. She's not going to swing from any chandelier, is she? <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> you did it! Get out of here now. Let's go! Bitch. Oh. Bringing it out for this one. Cool down! Let's go! If your kids feel bad, then it doesn't matter that my daughter feels bad. Your daughter is holding a national title and I will take it away in a minute! Go. Wow. Her voice went from feminine to Zeus in like all of 10 seconds. Mum's like, you know, she hasn't got her daughter, but she's got the most important thing. She's got all the trophies. That's that's all that matters. You know, get the trophies out of there quick before they get hurt. <laughs> you are uneducated mess. Quit drinking. I'm not going on the bus. So at walk. No one wants you on the bus by the looks of things. In this. <laughs> See, that woman's me. <laughs> Why am I here? <laughs> Who gives a shit? <laughs> I just let the girls dance and win trophies. For Christ's sake. Jill, let me see her costume. Okay, okay. this is the white costume. Okay. You did not whip that up last uh, night. Oh, I never said I whipped it up last night. You didn't say go home and whip up. I'm not Becky Homecky. I don't whip up costumes. Oh my God, do these women just hate each other? And where did that costume come from? Because it's obviously not pieces of something you pulled together. You haven't seen her in it. None of you have. I hate that. I hate when teachers, I know she's not a school teacher, but I hate it when like teachers of classes that your kids go to, the kids come home with homework that the kids can't do, all right? And you have to do it, okay? You have to do it. One time, my daughter came home, all right, side rant. My daughter came home from school once, okay? And she's like, Dada, Dada. Apparently, my daughter's Elmo. <laughs> she's like, Dada, we have to make a volcano that erupts. I'm like, the fuck? What? I'll just go dig up my garden, shall I? Get down to the core of the earth. Now, you know when you have to make those things and like shit spews out the top, whatever. So I was like, all right. Don't worry, I'm on it. I went down to the shops, bought some glue, bought some cardboard, some cellar tape. I bought some, what's, what's that, what's baking soda and shit. So, you know, I watched a YouTube video on how to make this, by the way. So it would spray out the top. I was like, this volcano, all right, could be used as a miniature for the next King Kong. That's how good it's going to look for my daughter. We sat down at the table. She's got the scissors in her hand. I'm like, right, let's go. I start duct taping shit, mixing green paint together. I look to my side. She's gone. Gone! She's left me! In 10 minutes, my daughter has gone upstairs. She ain't interested in shit! And not only that, she was like... What, four or something? She can't do this work, it has to be me! So then, I clocked it. I was like, okay, all the other kids, it's their dads doing it as well. I'm not just competing against other children here. I'm not just trying to make my daughter look good. I am competing against other dads. Now it's on. It's on. I stayed up all night! Painting this shit, putting details in. I was like, wow, shit, what else does this need? What else does this need? I went outstairs, I got gravel. I scraped moss off the wall. I put like... <laughs> this thing looked like you can step into it and you were, you were on set. You were on set. It was a miniature set, this volcano, and it was amazing. My daughter comes down in the morning. She looks at it. It's... She goes off. She goes off. She's like, oh my god! Oh, it's amazing! Oh my god, it looks, oh, everyone's gonna be so jealous! We walk to school, which is just down the road from where we used to live, and I'm I'm holding it, because she ain't holding it for shit. I, I have spent all night making this. I'm delirious. I haven't slept in years. As we get to the school gates, all right, there's, there's a teacher outside, like, greeting everyone. Good morning. Good morning. Sarah, all right, with no shame, Turns around, grabs it off me, runs up to the teacher, thrusts it in front of her, and the teacher's like, Oh, Sarah, did you do this? And the little bitch... <laughs> she just looks at her teacher and she's like... I was like, Oh! Oh! You did it, did you? Took credit for the whole fucking thing. No nothing. Nothing was rewarded to me. I wanted a sticker, all right? And what's worse is my daughter looks at me and then looked back at the teacher and was like, yeah, 
You did it. Okay, being in your room playing Minecraft all night was doing it. I thought, you know what, Daz? Don't say anything. Don't say anything. Just be, just be, just be an adult. Now is the time to be an adult, okay? You've made it for your daughter. That's the point. Let her walk into school, win this thing, and you can hold your head high. I went to pick her up from school. <laughs> this is a true story. I went to pick her up from school, and they'd already made, like, a pedestal for the work that had won. My work had won. It was in the, it was in the hallway. It was number one. It was on top there and it was like made made by sarah and that and then i don't know the teacher came up to me and she was like i bet you're proud and i couldn't help it i was like mm, mm. <laughs> of course she had a bit of you know help i did it <laughs> and the teacher looked at me she's like mr blackmore that is um that is very bad to take credit for your daughter's work like we, we're all here to celebrate and i'm like let me tell let me tell you something all right i haven't slept I'm covered in glue and baking soda. <laughs> I was like, I did it, me. <laughs> and uh, yeah, that was uh, that was the first time I realised that I'm an immature father. <laughs> hey, hey! All right, you gotta learn in life. You can't just sponge off other people's work. It's mine. <laughs> she won. That's the point. That's the side rant. Let's get back to dance, mums. <laughs> I don't care if somebody else in the world Whatever. plays it. Jill. Whatever. Whatever. Okay. How much does she smoke? Is she meant to be a dance teacher? That's a smoker's throat right there. Like a turkey on Thanksgiving about to be slaughtered. God damn it. Jill's throwing shoes and she's cursing and all I'm thinking is you are so hard to take seriously wearing that hat. Oh shit. <laughs> I was just thinking, what's the hat? It's not working. <laughs> Man. This is supposed to be just like a fun competition, but why do these mums take it so seriously? Why do they all hate each other so much? I think the hardest thing for Chloe is she asked Maddie if she was doing the duet, and Maddie lied to her. I don't expect anything less from Melissa. Maddie, yeah. did you lie to them? Oh, okay. Anyone who wants to know what a crazy driven mum looks like, that's, that's the face right there. You know? Ow! Oh! Oh, you're not doing the duet with my daughter? Ah! Okay, okay. <laughs> you know what? Here's the thing. You just keep your head up. Don't let all of that get to any of you. See, the mum knows what she's doing here. Everyone can see and hear her, which I'm sure is what she wants. And she's using the kid as if like, yeah, I'm just talking to my daughter. But really, you're rubbing everyone up the wrong way in the room. Like, you know, it's just called gaslighting. We know it's nice important. Man is perfect. You are perfect. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh! That's the response I would have given. No, Did you just know. sit here and say that my daughter looks miserable, so maybe we should put Kalani in her place? No, I never said yes, that. Yes, you most certainly no, did. No, I didn't, Dingbat. Listen! Dingbat? I guess you got to be creative around kids with swearing. You can't really swear too much, right? But Dingbat? I said, Brooke, is your mother Get speaking your for finger you? Do you out want to of be my up? face. Girls out the room. Yeah, you out the room. Oh, shit. She's trying to bite a finger off. Get away from me. See, that's the mum I told you who's, who's going to go off. She's just trying to. Did she mistaken that for a Kit Kat? Why was she trying to bite her? I said, Brooke. Is your mother Get speaking your for finger you? Do you out want to of be my face? Girls out the room. Yeah, girls. you idiot. Oh, oh, shit! Fucking piranha out here. Out the room. Get away from me. Out the room. Girls out of the room. Who do you think you are? Girls out of the room. How do these mums <laughs> go home at the end of the day and just act like they didn't behave like this? I swear it means more to them than it does the girls. No. She's crazy. No, I'm not crazy. You're eating my face. <laughs> to be honest, I'm kind of with her. I'm not crazy. You're eating my face. I mean, we all get hungry, but you never, you know, you never go for the face. 
she was eating her face. She was attempting cannibalism in front of children. Like, I would deem that more crazy than just yelling crazy mum. Right you know, the police have so much more to do than two mums trying to eat each other's fingers. Is there even a code for that on, on the radio? Sorry. Siri, when did you become a part of this? Hmm. I don't have an answer for that. Is there something else I can help with? No! Okay. Okay! You can go now! <laughs> what? Why is he getting involved? I honestly, I'd watch this show and I, I don't care how prestigious it is. My daughter would not dance with all this crap. But I got on the who, team. Wait, excuse me, but who gets... My mother is um, black South African, and let me tell you something, okay? When a black woman puts the hand on the hip and uses this hand to dictate shit. <laughs> that, that's when you know you need to shut up, all right? Woo! That's when I know my mum's pissed. Yeah, that's that's not true. For several months. I have backed Nia up with those pathetic feet for years. <laughs> Sound like the Tasmanian devil. Anyway, guys, uh, that was some compilation of dance mums. I still have no clue what the hell's going on. <laughs> but I'm, I'm going to give it a watch, actually. I'm going to go back and try and watch this. This actually looks like trash TV chef's kiss guys i hope you enjoyed today's video like love caress my channel can't wait to read your comments about how wrong i am about everything <laughs> and i'll see you in the next video stay dazzling